Spin the wheel, roll the dice, do some free pulls. Oh, Horan. Hey, what is up, guys? Guitarok here. Welcome back to another Brave 9 video. Guild Wars time with no salts. Okay, so hopefully uh, I'm able to test certain units right out um, in this particular Guild Wars battle. So there is plenty of interesting one. Okay, so Iram, there's Silencer. Empress Okay, so finally have the chance to attack the top castles again So we're gonna do our best Hopefully to get as much points as I can Yuri, okay, okay, very cool I like this strategy right here Yuri front I've heard that she can block as much So that's a very Pretty much a, a decently broken one And this one looks like a Okay, it looks like a very good One that means that Livia will wreck this this grand, depending on how early or how late she taunts. <laughs> isn't this isn't this like an easy formation? I'm trying to see. Is this even hard? I mean I thought it was scary at first, but Okay, there is Nartus though, okay. But can't you just block with Huh. Okay, let's let's go into the battle. I'm curious. Okay, so we know Nartus is going first. Rafitia to Christina. Uh-huh. And then 4, 5, Adin is going to bottom Okay, okay, so now... Yeah, I was looking at this formation and I was like Isn't this top lane... You can just block this with a 100% defense warrior? So... I feel like I can just do this I feel like I can just do this and I'm gonna be safe Like... Christina hits Lillian And then what, Yuri hits Lillian Angelica hits Lillian Grand hits Lillian. Can you really take care of Lillian? I don't think so, right? Nullify. I don't think you can nullify this. Can you? Can't be removed. Yep, can't be removed. So yeah, um, you can just use Lillian to block the top lane. Obviously, now that I think of it, you don't need Grand because this Grand will have torn. So I can use Livia to one-shot this Grand when round 2 comes. So isn't this like a safe strategy? Yeah, I know. Um, He's gonna move first, so he's gonna take care of my Lillian first But I feel like this is as as safe as it gets So ideally, 1, 2, 3, he's gonna go first And then I'm gonna go with uh, Asmut to Nia combo Take care of this Lucius, once and for all He's gonna come here, hit And then after that, I'll have Christina take care of the Glacier Hopefully through DOT And then when his add-in comes I will have my Dalvi go after Right? So that's the entire strategy so I place Dalby right here so that in case Lillian dies, this Angelica will come in and hit. Oh no, um, Yuri will come first, right? Yuri will come first, makes sense. I think Yuri will most likely be hitting a Glacia at that point because of Torn. Yeah, uh, just for security reasons, I'm just gonna place one Lucius right here. So we're gonna do something like this. I think this makes sense There's nothing that I think the enemy can actually do Yep, so we're gonna go in with this strategy right here This should work um, Yeah, never underestimate Lillian do not, do not sleep on Lillian She's very good in occasions like this Aha! Uh -huh. My turn Look at this, taking care of Lucius It's been so long since I've used Nia Oh Oh, Aha! Uh -huh. Add in Frozen! Add in Frozen! Boom! Add in Frozen! Rafitias alone! Yuri smack Lucius! Doesn't matter! Does it matter? Angelica come for me! Okay, so that does matter. Alright, alright, makes sense. Ah, uh, Grand hits. Okay, so now Natas will come Kabloom! Doesn't matter because Livia... Yeah, that, that's what I meant, right? So exactly, can Rafi be taken care of? Surprisingly. Oh, okay. So now Angelica will hit my Dalvi. Luckily, I positioned Dalvi in a pot in a skip tile, right? So in case in case things like that happen. Whew, all right, GG, we won. Lillian, man, look at that Lillian appearing, giving you the slap in the face. 
<laughs> it looks like she's giving you a slap in the face. I don't know the, the way the art works. Okay, so next up, we're going to try to hit the Empress. Okay, so what do we have right here? I see a Glacia. I see a Livia. I see a, a Grand. Albion Grand. Okay, okay. Nartus in the middle. Very cool strategy. Very cool strategy indeed. But, hmm. All right, let me see what I can do right here. It's kind of tough. Okay, so if you look at the enemy's team and formation, you know Natus is going first. Rafitia buffing Livia. Livia charge up. And then 4 to 5. So Albion Grand. Oh, he has Cecilia. That is very smart. That is very smart. That is actually very smart. Because Cecilia will have the priority because she's on the top lane, right? So when she's on the top lane means that you cannot, Yuri will not jump in and hit Gran uh, and kill Albion in the process. So Yuri will end up hitting Cecilia. So Cecilia can absorb the, the AOE from Yuri and she will be taking the hits from Yuri alone. So it's actually really smart if you think about it. How do I approach this? There's gotta be something. I can't, because they are, they are gonna have Torn at the beginning. So I can't use Lyudmila, right? If I use Lyudmila, yes, my Lyudmila might be able to kill Cecilia, but... Oh, I actually just thought of a very stupid strategy. But this stupid strategy might actually work. Okay. <laughs> so guess what stupid strategy I decided to came up with. Notice properly. I have Refitia Serubia to Lyudmila. Okay, so what this is gonna do is... This is gonna force Lyudmila to hit front as opposed to back. So Lyudmila is going to hit Rafitia instead. So right after that, since uh, Lyudmila has Torn Ignore, I don't have to worry about her trying to snipe Gran or Cecilia, right? So after that, I'm going to go in with Asmod. So take care of um, Natus with Assault Runes. Okay, okay, very cool. Natus with Assault Runes. I mean, it's, it's alright, makes sense. And then, yeah, there's Adin as well, right? So it's very tricky. Okay, I think I'm gonna move in like this. Do I even need Lucius? I've been thinking, do I even need Lucius? I guess it protects against this, but there's going to be Torn. So yeah, we're gonna try this strategy. I do think this will work. There is Glacier though. So can I deal with Glacier? Let me think. Six, yeah. So Glacier might be a problem. So I might need some sort of a DOT or something to get rid of her. So maybe I will go top. Maybe I will go a Christina somewhere. Christina. You know what? I don't think I'll be protecting uh, the middle lane. So we will just go to Christina just to get rid of the Glacier top. So looking at it, I don't see how this can fail because he will go in first with Gran. And then I go in with Lyudmila. Get rid of Rafi. He go in with Cecilia. And then I go in with Asmut to Dalby. So I'm not sure who Dalby will hit. Will, will the Torn still be there? I think I think Gran will still have the Torn. So Dalby will hit Gran. And then Seven. Lucius. Who's my Seven? Glacia. And then the Eight. Her. And then my Eight. Plum. And then Nine. Adin will hit my Glacia. Most likely. Hopefully Glacia survives. Now that's the scary part, right? Hopefully Glacia survives. Okay, so it looks like this strat should work. Although I don't really have multi-hit, but I should be fine. Yeah, we should be fine. I just noticed this Livia, enemy Livia is not plus 10. So there's no way... <coughs> At most, she's gonna try to one-shot my uh, Benshina along the way. So yeah, so we are gonna have... Oh crap, I forgot about that. Oh no! How did I forget about Serubia's placement? Ah, come on! Oof, that's so bad. How did I forget about that? Come on, man! Ugh. Yeah, we lost. Ah, we lost. Hmm. Okay, so enemy Glacia. And I will go in. No DOT. No DOT. Yep, that's a screw up for sure. Mistakes were made. I forgot that Serubia should not be placed right there in the open. That was my bad. That was my bad. 
Boom! Oh, we are still in it. We are still in it. That was a costly mistake. Oh my god, how did I let that happen even? Ah, I, was, I just wasn't thinking much at, at that point. I was overconfident. Okay, so have to restructure a little bit. I guess Serubia cannot die. If Serubia dies, this threat fails. Okay, so all I need to do was just to move Benshina down here. Damn, I screwed up hard for that part. Uh, otherwise, this strategy will definitely work. I'm gonna show you guys. There's no way it won't work. I'm pretty confident it will work. Alright, let's go. It's a silly strat at first, but if you think about it, Rafitia is not receiving her own buff right there from the enemy. So obviously, yep, so now I'm blocking that. Okay, so you guys will witness. So Rafitia, Kablam. Yep, right there, it works. So I'm going to go in with Asmuth and then Dalvi will hit Cecilia. So the entire strategy here from this point onwards is just hopefully I continue to have Torn. Mm -hmm. I will go in with, let's see, Adin hits me, no problem. I'll go in with Christina to the top lane, right? So hopefully that um, Glacia dies eventually from the OT and she did. Okay, same strategy applies. So this time, I take care of Adin. Albion buff Gran. Hit me again. And then, kaboom. So at this point, I'm pretty sure I won already. Like, you can... Like, it's definitely a working strategy. It's just... Uh, can you guys believe it? One mistake. Like, one positioning. Literally, all I did was move Benshina down one tile. Like... It's a huge... Like how the positioning can impact the outcome of the battle. Like look, no one on my team died right now. Like just now, literally get obliterated and now perfect win, alright? Not just a regular perfect win, it's like, it's like a, the most perfect perfect win because no one died at all. Like, ah, uh, that shows you like Guild Wars is just one small mistake, man. One small mistake. I'm a bit salty, uh, and I'm sure my guildmates are kind of upset as well because I'm wasting that attack chance right there and did not get any points. But yeah, sometimes um, I guess we need to learn from our mistakes and hopefully when I upload this video, when you guys watch this, hopefully you guys do not repeat the same mistake, alright? So if you guys are watching this from wherever, whatever guild you're from, so just be cautious, positioning, <laughs> very important. Alright guys, so that's gonna be it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you do, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think of the Serubia Ludmilla uh, strategy. Um, it's something that you guys can apply it in your guild battles as well. As always, I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Have a nice day. Goodbye.